Just put it in Lamer's perspective. Okay, so it was last Halloween, right? <laughs> I'm, oh. I'm trick-or-treating with a couple of my friends, right? And there are these two girls uh -huh. that are dressed up as Mario and Luigi, right? And uh -huh. they came across me. I turn around... And uh, I hear uh -huh. them yell my name. They say, hey, Eric. I'm like, hey, what's up? And I don't know them. I don't know their names. So I'm like, uh, like a few minutes later, they're still uh, kind of around me and my friends a little bit. They're a little bit further behind us, but they're catching up. And I said, is it cool if I tag along with y'all? And they said, sure, yeah. And so I'm like, all right, I'll catch up, catch up with you guys later. I joined them, which was a bit of a mistake because as soon as I joined them, not a few minutes later, after we hit a couple houses, I hear one. Of, I hear Mario say, "Eric, I love you." And I turn around. I'm like, "What the fuck?" Oh, did you that one chick that said that rider red was riding her bike? And was no. all like, "I fucking love you." No, that's some other chick. This this Mario chick is like, I would say the second encounter. Maybe the first, I don't know. And, um, mm. I think her other friend said the same thing. Um, oh, you could have had a game bang. <laughs> no, I was way too freaked out. I was like, no, you don't. I was like, shut up. No, you don't. They're, they're still following me and everything. But what's weird is, they actually meant it. That's not weird at all, Eric. You should have just went for it. You should have just went. I, pr I probably should have. When in doubt, Eric, when in doubt, zip it and whip it out. I'm going to say this right now. Over the summer, one day, my mom and I, um, fuck, what did we do? I forget what we did. I'm pretty sure we went grocery shopping or something. We stopped at McDonald's, right? And this this chick at the, like, uh -huh. the service window is the same chick that was dressed as the Mario. It's the same chick because she said, because I saw her, she looked familiar. I'm trying to like, I'm, I'm using my scanners. I am like matching, matching <laughs> numbers. I am, ident I am trying to identify, is this the same chick that's dressed up, that was dressed up as Mario on Halloween? And as soon as I, and as soon as Eric, like- you're so lucky, you're surrounded by so much fucking pussy, <laughs> and you're rejecting it! I'm not rejecting it, dude. You're she, no, 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 let me finish, let me finish. She looks in the, she looks in the car, she sees me, I see her, see me, see her. <laughs> She sees me, you see her, see me. <laughs> and she, and with a smile, I see her braces and she says, oh, hey, Eric. I look at her, and I, I drop my jaw. I was like, I didn't know her name. I didn't want to go like, oh, hey, you, what's your name? I didn't want to, I didn't want to seem like a jackass. I don't, I didn't know her name. To this day, I still you know don't. What I, but, you know what I say? Oh, hey, what's up? Well, that's that's name. actually what I said. I said, "Oh, hey, what's going on?" <laughs> and I kind of hope I run into her again. You just see her in the same outfit, but this time she's like in skimpier clothing. As soon as she finds me, as soon as I hear those magic words, <laughs> Eric, I love you. You're gonna ask her on a date. Ask her on a date. Ask her on a date. A date. Ask, ask her, her on, on a date. date. Ask her on a date. Fan Ask her fiction, on a date. Fan fiction. Fan, fan fiction. fiction. Create the fan fiction. No! Fuck you, Evan. Quickly. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Say it with me, everyone. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Send fiction. Fuck. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Say it with me, everybody. Fan fiction. Say it with me, everyone. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. Fan fiction. I wanted to talk to her so bad, but I was like, what comes to mind first? I can't have my mom know about this, because she'll have questions that I can't answer. And I don't want to talk about this story to her, because it's weird to talk about in front of your parents. You know, like, what did this chick say? What? Like, how does she know you? I, like, I don't know how she knows me. I don't know her.
but she knows me somehow. Maybe, maybe her friends told her about me or something. All I can tell you is that I don't know her name, and I don't know anything about her. I honestly thought that something like this would never happen, and Evan, you told me that, like, one day we were playing Dead by Daylight, right? Uh, I'm sorry. sorry and, and I go to the survivors list, right? And you said that there's, like, this, like, character that's using the same fucking face as this one chick that you saw at the beach and you saw her staring at your crotch. That looks like the girl that was at, that I saw at the beach and she just looked at my crotch and I was staring at her and I just noticed she was staring at me and then we both looked at each other and that, that's the face she made. I don't know if you're... <laughs> I don't know if you're if that if like that was a dream you had or if it's just a joke or if that really happened. No, it's not. It's, dude, this act it actually fucking happened. I oh swear. God. At the beach. At the beach. Fucking happened. She doesn't look like it, it, this person doesn't look like her, but she's using the same fucking face. <laughs> yeah. That's something unique that's happened to you. She's staring at your crotch, giving you this look. I'm getting like the immediate proposal. I'm getting the immediate I love you. Hey, she wanted me for the six inches, dude. They want you for how you act. No, they want me for my what, moonwalk. You think I don't want that? They want me for my moonwalk and I'll be like I was freaked out that night because no girl has ever said that to my face. They obvi and they especially didn't mean it. When I say it, I on I honestly mean it. I mean it from the bottom of my heart. I've said it to Who else other than my family? Oh yeah, there's this one chick uh, when I was a freshman, it was the last day of school. I was actually also praying that that's, that that chick at the um at the McDonald's like service window thing didn't say that out loud in front of my mom because if she had <clears throat> I would have some serious explaining to do your ass cheeks would be connected to your face and your ass cheeks would be replaced with your uh, cheek faces and your testicles would be rep would be turned inside out to the point where the inside of your testicles are on the outside of your testicles With the shit. I don't know. <laughs> That's what happens when you live in California. I was also kind of hoping that she like wouldn't say it as we drove off with the food. She, she just looks at the car like I love you, and then, and then my mom would punt like step on the brakes, and I, and then she like, Ugh. it's too much. My door is open. I really hope nobody is listening to this conversation. Everybody's downstairs. But still, I really hope nobody heard all of this. Heard what? This story that I just told you. I finally got, like, the time to shave and shit, and now my face feels smooth and I look like a baby again. Bruh, I just shaved! You did?! Did we just become best friends? Uh, yes, we did. You wanna do karate in the garage? Fuck yeah. People, let me tell you about my best friend. He's a one.